Oh my god, I am terribly, terribly sorry for the last uh, time I uploaded. The voice was so bad. I realize this now. Actually, I didn't uh, realize this when I was mixing. I did mix it. I did the mix part very quickly. So sorry. I'm going to start the YouTube tutorial again. The with better voice. So what we are going to do today is we are going to make alpha basically with the blended nodes for the times when we do not have alpha maps what our alpha maps are they are basically when we have to make a tree yeah or leaf uh, leaf is a quite better example so when we make a leaf and uh, what we can do is we have to make the leaf transparent so we can apply onto our plane and it, it will leave structure on a plane only so the white portion here as you can see it's going to be displayed the black portion as you can see here is going to be transparented or cut cut out so like this leaf here now imagine the green portion is visible and the and this part is cut it out how do we do that we make a alpha map black and white so the white portion will allow the texture to be visible the black portion allows the texture to be transparent so in case if we don't have that and we have make a wings what we can do is right here in this tutorial so as you can see the wings here i just bought this model so sorry i just got this model from internet so here you can see the wings and let me just zoom it out a bit wing what we are going to do is we can take the wings from here and let me just cycle it out and you can see it, these are transparent but i did not use any alpha map for this how did i do that i will explain it in it in a bit sorry about my accent though uh, it's very new to me i just started making these youtube tutorials and the previous one was my first one so i screwed up big time but I promise to give so one more thing this will only work in cycles it won't work on eve it can work on eve but i haven't tried it yet so for cycles and and one more thing i love cycles why but because it does calculate the light much better it takes its time i realize that but so if you are going to if we going to see the node structure here it's all really messed up i'm going to explain how i did that in a very very simple manner now now i'm going to rotate the b rotate the model so you can see its better reflection so what is the uh, most important part is for this tutorial whenever we apply the material if you have just a single map diffuse map like i do have here the wings are in this texture only whole body and the wings in one texture so what we are going to do is we are going to make two different materials one we are going to apply the alpha node one we are going to leave as it is so the alpha one i name it material 002 the as it is one 001 the 002 part the alpha part i'm going to apply it on wings now i'm what i'm going to do is i'm going to separate the wings out so that it doesn't mix up with the normal this body thing sorry <laughs> first time so assign it so let me just explain this structure real quick i'm going to delete this part so i can have a better you can have a better understanding we all can have a better understanding yeah. let's come to this so first select the texture coordinator and select the uv node and connect it to your 
texture node to the vector part right in the vector and here we have our output so let's make the middle part so what we are going to use is rgb to bw why because these are essentially colors that we are turning into black and white why black and white that i have explained earlier in this video uh, the white portion it's going to allow the light to pass the black portion we are going to cut it out that's why it converts it to black and white now let's take an example and for this part i will not use music i guess because it did destroy my narration last time so so as i explained this is a perfect image like you can see the white portion here now understand this wherever my what whatever information i want to pass is going to be in the white portion whatever information i want to get transparent it's going to be a black portion this is what alpha map is it's simple it's really simple you can make it in photoshop also but uh, this really is when you don't have the, the time or the resources and you was you just want to get the quick part so it's for that but it's really informative i promise you now select the bump part why because we want to get bumps on our the reflection thing on the wings it's really handy if you use bumps so you can strength whatever you want to i'm going to leave it as one connect the bw part the black and white part the sorry the volume part of the black and white node to a height remember that now one diffuse connect your color to diffuse one more glossy for the reflection connect the color from this one also and yes collect uh, the bump is going to be normal at normal because the normal does contain bumps so one more connection there so what we are going to do next is we are going to select a mix shader so we can mix it up a bit mix the nodes and uh, one we are going to connect one transparent vsdf to the upper one to get the transpa transparency obviously now we have to connect the alpha to the fac value of the mix shader and let's place it a bit now we have these two nodes these two outputs that we are we want to get into the surface so naturally the mix shader connect it like this and this and and connect the shader all together what oh okay come on this is embarrassing me yaar <laughs> i'm super stupid yep there you go so and in a minute uh, we will see the magic come on yeah there you have it you can see the transparency uh, the wings is transparent translucent actually it's not transparent for the wing effect so we so that's why we added the bump so we can change the fac value to uh, likeliness if you down decrease the value you can see the transparency part you can make it more transparent or you can make it translucent by selecting some by increasing some like this okay i guess it is now as you can see here it is it is done it's really simple so ah uh, this was about it but there's a there's one more tutorial uh as you can see the body here 
One minute. Yeah, you can see the body here. It's there are bumps in it, and you may think that it's normal map. Actually, I only have diffuse for this model. Now I made the bumps from the diffuse part only, the, the diffuse map only. How I did that is I'm going to explain it in my next video. You can see, and we will discover how the how we can add bumps like normal map without a normal map like if you have a situation like this what we are going to do so i'm going to rotate the model so we can have a better look now uh, just for you guys and that's it also i make quite good movies i also make 3d movies i will you can check it on my channel it does have a playlist naming 3d shopping okay see ya